I paint so big because I can't stand the paint little. I, I can't stand the confines of a very small canvas. And it takes me as long to paint something small as it does large. And I enjoy seeing a painting grow large on a canvas. Botanicals instead of people because I'm around people all the time and I like to escape into the botanicals. I love teaching painting outside the classroom because I do have my own teaching classroom right there at my house. And since I've retired, I get a lot of joy out of continuing to work with students and people who want to learn about color theory and painting and composition. I see color in things through looking for little nuances that lead to a particular color. You have to learn how to do that to see all the colors in things. It takes training your eyes and um, knowing what makes up particular colors to actually put them together and see what color is actually there. I have two studios. One is a teaching studio that has tables and easels and a lovely atmosphere. The other one is a little hole in the wall that is my studio that I love to paint in. I would hope that there is a connection between teaching and learning with my students. If there is not, then I as an instructor, I think has failed because without that connection, they can't learn. In preparation to paint a picture is to gather multiple photographs that I have taken and put them all together to create a painting. I have always used multiple photographs for size, for color, for value, for ideas, to change backgrounds, to change the picture totally. I think talent is both God-given and something that you have to work for in any field. I think we, as artists, are given a certain amount of talent, but a lot of people don't ever do anything with it. So if, if you're not willing to work and grow that talent and push that talent that is God-given, then you don't succeed at it. I think art has a great many functions for people. It can give them a lot of enjoyment. It can be something that gives a message or makes them think, whether it's political, economic, or, or social, or religious. I think everyone can be an artist in their own right. I think art can change the world one person at a time.